welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Ebony where we're all things nursing, cooking, and lifestyle. If you're new to my channel, hey woo hey. And if you like this video or any of my other videos, please don't hesitate to subscribe, like, and tell a friend. So before I really start, I just want to make a disclaimer that I did not go see a doctor before I started this. I actually got the idea from my grandma. My grandma was losing a lot of weight by doing what I'm about to tell you. And so I just jumped on the bandwagon. But I do say if you are going to try this, make sure that you talk with your physician um, or your provider. Um, you know, if you have any health conditions or medical conditions, just make sure you talk to them before you begin this diet. So I started this on May 18th and on May 18th I weighed in before I ate anything. I just woke up, weighed in and girl and boys, that scale said 212 pounds. And I was like, girl, what? Couldn't believe it. Never been over 200 pounds before ever in my entire life. Um, I think the highest I've ever been was 196. So I was definitely teetering up to the 200, but I had never reached it. So when I got on the scale and I saw that, I was like, mm -mm, girl, you, you got you to gotta get it together. So um, I did all my measurements and everything. I got my way and all that stuff. And so I started. So what I did was simply two meal replacement shakes in one sensible meal. So I actually have a bottle right here, the Premier Protein Shakes, the prepackaged ones. They also have powder um, that you can just make your own shakes, but this was just a little bit more convenient. Of course, a little bit more expensive because of the convenience, but this is what I did. I did two of these a day and I did one sensible meal. So this Premier Protein um, has 160 calories, 30 grams of protein, one gram of sugar, so very low in sugar, low fat, 24 vitamins and minerals. So, you know, it does okay. It's good. It, it says it's good for, um, where does it say that? You can use it as a meal replacement or you can use it as a snack. So I was just using it as a meal replacement. So the things that I would eat would be mainly chicken and vegetables. So I would, you know, grilled chicken or sauteed chicken. I would never eat fried chicken, of course. And I'll have vegetables like broccoli, zucchini, you know, anything like that, asparagus. And, and I definitely had a lot of salad. So if I had a salad, I'll make a really big bowl of salad with my tomatoes and cucumbers and grilled onions and crunchy onions with my grilled chicken and um, some ranch and I would just have a big salad at the end of the day. So for the Premier Shakes, they're all 160 calories, I believe. They have different types of Premier Protein Shakes, but this is just the regular original one. Um, so all of these type are 160 calories. This one I have right here is the Peaches and Cream. I also have vanilla, I also have chocolate, which tastes just like chocolate milk if you like chocolate milk. Um, what else? Cafe Latte, which is like a mocha coffee type thing. I liked all of them. I mainly drank this one like the first week and a half. I did it and I kind of got tired of it, so I switched it up. So yeah, all of them the same calories, so you don't have to worry about that. And so I counted these and I had two of these, so 320 calories. And then for my dinner, I would try to have like a sick, no more than 700 calorie dinner. And I probably didn't even you know reach that so i would try to stick to about i don't want to say a thousand because it really wasn't hardly ever a thousand 320 plus 600 so about 900 calories 900 to a thousand calories a day is what i kind of stuck to so of course i was easy because i was only eating chicken and vegetables i wasn't eat, eating anything fried anything starchy or anything like that other than the sweet potatoes but you know so yeah it's very simple to follow and I got my results and I'm ready to continue on with my weight loss journey this is my first video regarding weight loss and um, you'll definitely see more as time progresses so how I did it was I ate the meal replacements first and then I would have my actual meal for dinner so I would wake up 8 9 10 and at that point I would just drink water until 12 so I drank three liters of water per day as well so a liter of water is about 33 um, ounces so I got a, I had a 32 ounce bottle so I had my first 32 ounces by 12 o'clock 
and then at 12 I'll have my first meal replacement shake then 12 to 3 I will have my second liter of water then at 3 I will have my second meal replacement shake and then from 3 till I go to bed I'll have you know my third liter of water and then about 7 or 8 I will have my actual meal whether it be a salad with grilled chicken or the chicken and vegetables and so that's what I did for the first week for the most part if I ever got hungry I would give me some carrots and ranch or cucumbers and ranch or you know some um, cashews or pistachios just a very light snack if I was just so hungry and I just needed something to eat so that first week I lost nine pounds in the first week well, you know the second week came around I was feeling myself because I had lost nine pounds and I was like mmm maybe I could switch it up a little bit so I did so that week I kind of geared off the two meal replacements and I just did one meal replacement and two small meals so same thing the chicken and the vegetables i added in salmon that week i added in sweet potatoes that week um so that's the only starch i ate was sweet potatoes during this whole 21 days so that week i kind of ate a little bit more than i did the previous week and that week i lost three pounds so you know not as good as the first nine pounds but you know still losing weight i forgot to say that first week was definitely the hardest week just because my body is not used to me being so strict in eating i went from you know eating whatever which i don't eat a lot but i do eat a lot of fast food if that makes sense so um yeah i, I eat a lot of fast food <laughs> i love i love zaxby's i love chick-fil-a anyway that's another story for another day but yeah so it went from you know eating whatever I wanted to to a lot of french fries I love french fries you know a lot of drinks that's my that's my biggest thing is sweet drinks like I'll get every time I go to the grocery store I'll get me a you know a bottle of lemonade or you know a cream soda I love cream soda grape juice is my favorite juice which is of course is has the highest amount of sugar that all the other fruit juices so like that was my main thing so it was definitely difficult from you know going to that extreme to another extreme but i just kept pushing through and that's where i saw my biggest results so i, I just say that to say your first week is definitely going to be the hardest at least it was for me but you push through and you you be strict this is discipline and if you can put your mind to it and you know this is what you're gonna do your body will follow and that's what happened i put my i put my feelings my emotions and my cravings under subjection and i got the results that first week now the second week i kind of ventured off a little bit like i said i had two small meals and one shake sometimes i didn't even drink a shake sometimes i would just have the two small meals and i lost three pounds and i kind of did the same thing the third week as well um i was kind of switching i you know some days i did two shakes and one meal some day i did two small meals sometimes i did one shake one meal i just kind of switched it up that last week same thing chicken salmon uh fish you know all lean meats i also had some ground turkey the second and third week as well so yeah i just kind of ventured off and again i lost three pounds the third week so the first week nine second week three third week three so i lost a total of 15 pounds in 21 days and honestly after i got finished with it it was actually something that was really doable i did it um it's not like i'm gonna do this forever definitely not it was just something to you know get me on track to where i want to go because i have a lot more to lose girl so yeah now i'm 197 i just got back from vacation i'm ending this week so this week i've kind of just been eating whatever but this upcoming monday i'm gonna start you know i'm gonna detox again not with the shakes but with something else i'll make a video on that you know once i finish with it just detox my body so that i can start um to see the results again and get constant results so yeah i definitely don't recommend this for a lifestyle type thing but it's definitely good if you want to detox your body and if you want to get ready to make lifestyle changes because it definitely is something that you have to work on when it comes to weight loss. It's like a gradual thing. And I don't really believe in fads like quick ways to lose weight, but I definitely believe that you should detox your body, get your mind and your body ready for what you're going to do. I also, as you can tell by the title, I also did not do any, hardly any exercise when I lost this. So, that just shows you how, how, um, how serious and how important it is to watch what you eat. It's 80% what you eat and 20% exercise. So, literally, I may have walked five or six days out of the 21 days, you know, two, three miles, if that, um, 
out of the 21 days so i did hardly any you know extraneous exercise or hardly any exercise for that matter um and i lost those 15 pounds so like i was just you know like i said i'm just trying to get my red my body ready for when i go back to the gym and start working out again and you know eating right and watching what i eat and all that it just kind of gets you prepared for that so yeah i think that's about all i have to say about it it's very simple you know simple thing to do i, I know this is not really a long video but it's really you know just as simple as i said um two meal replacements and one sensible meal and you can switch it up like i did um, so yeah, if you guys have any questions, put them in the comment section and I will try to answer them. And yeah, that's all I have to say and I will see y'all in my next video.